they have to meet hours before the game and go over new hand signals so that the other side isn't getting it. And, and I guess it does take to the level of literal war that this type of stuff's going on. So here's my point. Regardless of whether you think the Seahawks cheated, and they're hiding it in plain view, just admitting they did this. That's how arrogant and corrupt things have gotten. Regardless of what your view is about that, that's why we don't live in glass houses. That's why we have privacy. That's why we have encoding and encryption on our email. That's why you pull your blinds down at night, especially if you live in a high rise. That's why you lock your doors. It's because you do certain precautions to up your level of security and safety and privacy. And the basic instinct of a bird is to try to roost in a nest behind some leaves or in a hollow of a tree. Why? For security. And if you don't have privacy, you have no security. They've sold this equation of no privacy equals security. That's two plus two equals a thousand. It's pure bull. No. No security equals tyranny. Just like Peyton Manning didn't have his hand signed secret to his team, so they lost the game. And the people got a terrible game that was a shutout, basically, because of cheating, like a Don King fight, where the guys walk out, one guy's been told to fall at the beginning of the third. So he lets the other guy kind of beat him up. The other guy isn't too mean because he knows it's staged. They act like it's a boxing match. And every one of them's totally rigged on record. And so now, now people don't watch professional boxing because they know it's rigged. And you ruin the sport. Same deal. Just like you ruin a free market by having a rigged economy with insiders that are exempt from the regulations and things they foist upon the people. So that is the lesson of Super Bowl 48 and how it was stolen. Not by skill, not by prowess, not by focus, not by who worked out the hardest. No. It was stolen because they, they cracked the hand signs. And so the game wasn't about who was the strongest or who could catch the best or who had the best pass routes down, who had the best linebackers, who, or who had the best offensive or defensive linemen, or who had the best quarterback. It was about who could cheat, basically. Well, if Goldman Sachs and J.P. Morgan, with their uh, divisions on Wall Street, create super fast uh, trading algorithms where they hook computers directly into the stock market of the Dow Jones Industrial Average and siphon off a couple billion a day, rigging the whole thing, it starts really discrediting the stock market. And then when they take 40-something trillion dollars the last six years, seven years since 2008, and pump it directly into the stock market, and it goes up to you know, 16, 17, 18,000, I mean, of course it's going to do that because you're putting fiat money in to the only bubble that's left. And you're like, well, let us live by bubbles and that's all we've got. Hey, I hear you. I don't want it to pop. The problem is it gives the insiders who are in control of the bubble first dibs on the money, insider trading, insider knowledge on trillions of dollars a month. Meanwhile, they'll arrest Martha Stewart over stuff that clearly wasn't illegal. They'll try to put uh, the owner of the of the Dallas Mavericks in jail because he he criticizes Bush. Obama is now you know arresting filmmakers that criticize him with the Justice Department that ran Fast and Furious. This is what it's like to live in a mafia system, and this is why you do not want to have crony capitalist monopoly insider systems because they wreck competition, they wreck markets. General Electric for six years has gotten hundreds of waivers on their power plants to run dirty while their competition isn't even allowed to run completely clean. And the response is a doubling of, of energy prices the last five and a half, six years in the United States on average, a doubling in your electricity. And for the select groups that get to turn their plants up full blast and, and, and their competition gets mothballed or fined, as Obama said, you can build a coal power plant, but we will bankrupt you. He means he'll bankrupt who isn't part of his gang, General Electric, that the last four years, guess how much General Electric paid in the last four years in taxes? Zero. 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 And, he, and the head of General Electric ran Obama's economic council, and he lobbied to raise your taxes if you made over 125000 a year. A couple quarter mil. Because he's a bastard. He's a piece of trash. He wants that money in banker bailout money that General Electric wanted, just like just like Warren Buffett. You want to know why I dislike Warren Buffett, that gangster trash? It's because...
They're running my life. They're the ones taxing me. They're the ones shutting down my economy. They're the ones squeezing poor people. They're our enemies. They've got the inside codes. They got the NSA data. What's making Americans sick and fat? It's too many GMO foods and toxins destroying our digestive systems, causing poor digestion and suppressed immune systems. A suppressed immune system prevents clear thinking and the ability to fight the corporate and big pharma agendas. Detox now with Pro-EM1 from Terraganics. Pro-EM1 liquid probiotic is wheat, dairy, and soy-free, gluten-free, and made with all non-GMO certified organic ingredients. Pro-EM1's power is based in good bacteria, live microbes, and all their metabolites, including vitamins, amino acids and enzymes that support a healthy digestive system, suppress pathogens, and eliminate toxins. Pro-EM1 is the key to your digestive health. Order Pro-EM1 Daily Probiotic Cleanse at Terraganix.com, spelled T-E-R-A-G-A-N-I-X.com, or call toll-free 866-369-3678. That's 866-369-3678. Also available through Amazon Prime. Pro-EM1 from Terraganix. Life's getting better. Hi folks, Alex Jones here with some important information. I want to tell you about Matt Redhawk and his team of patriots over at My Patriot Supply. Several years ago, Matt was sitting in his two-bedroom apartment, frustrated with the direction this country was headed, and the charlatans willing to sell us out for a quick buck. Deciding to take action, a company run by Patriots for Patriots was born. My Patriot Supply has never taken a loan or accepted outside funding. They now operate two distribution facilities and employ over 50 hardworking American men and women. It is rare to find companies who practice what they preach. And that's why I stock my pantry with high-quality storable foods from My Patriot Supply. Go to MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex today for special offers on emergency food storage or call their preparedness specialist at 866-229-0927. That's 866-229-0927. Do business with someone who shares your values. MyPatriotSupply.com slash Alex. By now, you may know that a Bitcoin is the first decentralized currency that's easily transferred from person to person over the Internet. No bank needed. This means lower fees and accounts can never be frozen, limited, or closed. Plus, a large number of businesses and merchants already accept Bitcoins. And Bitcoins are easily exchanged for dollars, euros, and more. If you're interested in making money in the Bitcoin market right away, and by right away we mean start making money today, please visit us at cloudhashing.com. Cloudhashing.com is one of the fastest growing Bitcoin miners in the world, delivering the highest profits to people just like you. To get started, join us at cloudhashing.com and you will start mining Bitcoins right away and get paid daily. You heard correctly. You will receive payments every single day. And the best part? You do not need a computer or need any experience in mining Bitcoins. It's perfect for everyone. Learn more at cloudhashing.com. Just like it sounds, cloudhashing.com. Start making money today at cloudhashing.com. Get the ultimate knife at the ultimate price. The Fox Karambit Knife. Finally available in the U.S. The Fox Karambit Knife opens with one hand faster than you can pull a handgun. For utility, for defense, and for way less than other knives of this caliber. Go to TheUltimateKnife.com. Truly the best knife you will ever own. And only available at TheUltimateKnife.com. Use promo code RADIO at checkout for free shipping. Get the ultimate knife at the ultimate price. At TheUltimateKnife.com. Nobel Prize winner Alexis Carroll, cell biology researcher, discovered a detoxified and nourished cell lives in a state of eternal youth. Clean cells will result in improved energy, mood, blood sugar, liver function, and skin health. Also, you can lose fat and keep or gain muscle and reduce or eliminate inflammation and more. To discover how to detoxify and nourish the 100 trillion cells of your body, call this free recorded message at 866-844-1047. That's 866-844-1047. the bottom line folks your data is valuable your privacy is key and if you don't have your privacy you're not free you're a slave notice government wants more privacy than ever it's come out that congress has secret slush funds they live lavish lifestyles with and that they've exempted themselves from almost every law well that's how this works 
That's how the globalists operate. That's what they do. And it's so elementary that they have just trained us to put up with anything and everything in this country. And now, as I told you a decade ago, it's mainstream news. Google, Microsoft, Amazon for that matter, anybody that has hundreds of millions of people visiting them are able to predict the future with almost 100% precision to the point of Amazon now is testing and successfully doing it for a month, shipping packages Packaging them, preparing them, and even shipping them before you order off of how your mouse moves over things, off your whole database history. They buy these NSA databases. That's the big dirty secret is the whole Internet has been built and set up and designed and readied to read your mind. And then if they can read your mind and predict what you're going to do, they can then put stimuli in to manipulate what you're going to do. And that has a name. It's called mind control, the end of free will. I mean, is it fun to be in a world where everything's rigged? Is it fun to watch a football game that's 40-something to eight because they know what the other team's about to do and, and, and are able to basically cheat? I would not want to play a card game if I knew what cards my friends were going to be getting. I like to play cards when I have time. Poker, you name it. I'll play Uno with my kids, Go Fish, you name it. War, Solitaire. Would you play a game if you knew the outcome? Uh, would you um, get married if you knew the outcome? Would you have kids if you knew there was a predisposition, I can't even say the word, predisposition that... Down the road, you might have some type of physical problem. Of course, they won't tell you that it's also what's in the environment that triggers that. They lie to you and say, oh, don't have kids now because you've got a 30% chance you're going to end up having a child that has some type of genetic disorder. And then now you're in the brave new world of picking and choosing the babies, but not even for a better race, quote, unquote. No, no. Now social engineering piggybacking into all the technology, genetic, electronic, digital, the systems of control to end free will so a bunch of globalist technocrats can literally play God. And so that's why I saw that article this morning about the Seahawks cracking Peyton Manning's code. And you notice they said they did it right at the start of the game because it's considered cheating if you break it before. So they went, oh, we broke it right at the beginning. <laughs> yeah, sure you did. And they're saying that because they know it's going to come out later. So I guarantee you their coaches told them, don't be like the uh, Patriots that lied about it. Get out front of it. See, I know how these propaganda operations work because I've watched it so many times. They just hide it in plain view. And, and they've gotten away with so much. In New York State, they're saying it's the law to take flu shots now on top of another 15 shots or so they claim are law and mandated to be in school. There's no law to take any of those vaccines. There's a waiver. But the law just says they'd like you to sign a waiver with the health department. It's the same in all 50 states that you're not going to get the vaccine and, quote, understand the dangers. Then they use that as a database of people to persecute who are not inoculated. But nevertheless, Rick Perry said nine years ago, it's the law, you've got to take Gardasil shots, or eight years ago. There was no law, we pointed that out, the hoax imploded. Mexico's an authoritarian state, they actually passed a law saying all girls have to take it. And it'll come out later, most of them are sterilized. And the average, yep, you'll go, there's too many people. But you're sterilized too, dummy. It's done covertly. And if a government can do that covertly and lie and say it's the law, you think there's not other stuff going on? They're lying about flu shots. They're lying about Gardasil shots for human papillomavirus. They're lying. Oh, by the way, they didn't tell you if you're infected with one of the known 8,000 strains of human papillomavirus, that it actually reduces a whole group of common cancers down to almost nothing, that it's a natural inoculation, warts in the environment to viral cancer. That, those studies have been out for 70 years, but it's conclusive now. That's why people that take the Gardasil shot, massive cancer increases. Their ovaries basically melt as well. But hey, if you like endometriosis, if you like your ovaries shutting down, if you like your body eating itself, if you like dying, take it. We're on the